And welcome back. Uh, this part's about bolts. Yay. Um, yeah, not much to say. Let's go. Alright, so remember... Okay, so actually I am a Blue Power Ranger now. I was going to say, uh, that, that guy looked like me. Maybe I look like him, I don't know. Alright, let's continue. Yeah. Alright, so... Cool, I have... I kind of regret leaving behind that, uh... That post, uh, that ring of magic resistance now, and I might actually go back for it. Mm. I don't know. I don't know. <clears throat> I need to because the uh, the blue guy's hex thing is a hex, so you can actually resist it. So having protection from magic might actually be good here. Uh, I'm not sure though. We'll see. Uh, if if I if I end up getting like really badly marked and like turns out really badly. If I survive that, I'll, I'll probably just go get it. But for now, we'll, we'll see if I, I even need it. I might not. And then it would just be a waste of turns. Uh, yeah. What's over here? What's over here? Oh, it's the yellow guy. Okay, so Tokima's dance is, again, re is going to be really effective in this place. Uh, mostly because the Convokers and stuff have fairly low MR, I guess. Not, not, not amazingly low, but somewhat lower. You should be able to affect it with most of your stuff. And um, Tukima's Dance works really well against humanoid enemies that rely on their weapon, their cool weapon, like this guy, uh, to do damage. So he doesn't do anything to me pretty much at all. Uh, that's kind of cool. Uh, I'm gonna just confuse these. They're undead. Okay, so there's a couple of enemies over here. They're gonna just get stabbed, right? Oh, this one wakes up. It's okay. I can beat him to death. Okay, so... Uh, I wasn't really clear last video by what I meant by uh, short blades was up to six. I mean short blades is up to six before Ash and Zari stuff, and the reason why I'm considering that is because I'm gonna curse. I'm gonna take off the curse of my weapon, and that's gonna reduce the amount of uh, skill boost that he gives. He's not gonna give me any skill boost for things that I haven't cursed on. So yeah, I, I need to think about the bases. I, I know it's. I probably should just curse on the uh, Demon Blade once I'm done with it, but, you know, uh, just in case I, I get a really nice stab that I want to get. I'm not really sure what's going to happen. Alright, cool. Uh, it's really hot here right now. Um, I know Australia is, like, really hot compared to the rest of the world. Kind of, I guess. But it shouldn't be that hot right now, but for some reason, I, I guess my laptop's been heating up the room. Uh, it's pretty hot. I don't know. I might go turn on the aircon at some point, but I'm worried that the uh, the noise will be kind of annoying, so I won't I won't do that actually. I'll just sit here, be hot. Uh, can these guys see invisible? No, they can't. Cool. Stab, stab, stab. So, uh, yeah, invisibility is back to being useful again. I guess it it has some uses now, rather than before where it had none. Uh, and Tukima's dance is gonna be real great. It's going to be the main tool that I guess we use. Uh, you can even use it against double-headed ogres. Uh, fun fact, they actually... Oh, there's a siren. Someone's doing crime. That's bad. Anyway. Tukim's Dance uh, only disarms the first weapon that they're wielding. So, for the specific uh, case of double-headed ogres, two-headed ogres, you actually have to use it twice. But it gives you twice the DPS, so... I don't know, there's a trade-off, I guess. And they are giant spike clubs, so they do quite a bit of damage. Uh, just a little bit of a niche case. Alright, let's keep going. Uh, I really want to get that stab. I didn't get it. Okay. I'm going to just go invisible, and then I'm going to fight the guys that can not see, uh, that can see invisible first, and then I'm going to stab everyone else. Um, do I have any spells that do... No, I have no necromancy. Okay. Alright, so this guy is going to summon a whole bunch of dudes. Uh, that's okay. I'm going to go invisible. For some reason, the yellow ones, uh, the yellow Convokers... Hey, get out of here. For some reason, the yellow uh, Convoker ones... Please. Oh, right, I don't have a very good chance of killing it. Okay. For some reason, the Convokers are... Yeah, they, they, they can't see this. I don't know why that's the case. It's a weird niche case. I don't know. Most other ones can, I think. So this guy really doesn't want to let go of his weapon. He's just... He's holding onto that thing for dear life. Uh, maybe he'll give it up when he's dead. Let's see. 
Uh, no, please. Okay, yeah, give me that. I'm gonna drop it right here, just out of disdain. I miscast invisibility. That's gonna be kind of scary. I'm gonna get it. I'm going to get marked soon. That's also pretty scary. Uh, yep, I got marked. Uh, I need to kill this guy ASAP. Um, I need to kill this Vault Warden because he's blocking my way out. All right, good. I can leave now. That's. I was a little bit scary, but I, I knew that, you know, if if worse come to worse, I could just run away. But yeah, killing the Vault Warden was critical there. I'm going to invis now, because most of these guys can't see invis. Uh, even if they can, I'll deal with them first, and that's fine. So yeah, the proper way to deal to do use uh, see invis is use it offensively, unless there's enemies that can see you, then you use it defensively. So you pretty much just use it to buffer against enemies that can't see you. Uh, if that makes any sense. Uh, let me think. Is there a way to say it more, uh, more sensically? I guess you use it. Uh, I don't know. Also, uh, another weird interaction that I guess I noticed. Uh, using Tukima's dance on an asleep enemy wakes them up. Uh, don't really ask me why. I don't know. Uh, yeah. So this this thing is using a lot. This this both invisibility and Tukima's dance, which are two spells that I pretty much didn't use at all the last branch. Uh, they've become really helpful in bolts. Uh, I'm continuing to train my long blades. Uh, fighting is up. Charms is up. Haste is going on right now. I want that. Good. Thank you. I'm going to drop both my books now. Oops, that's not the book. Hang on, how does this work? Alright, sick. Alright. Uh, I am Red Contam, uh, for some reason. Ah, oh, sorry. Yellow Contam. So, let's see. Interesting, I didn't get mutes. Uh, I don't know what that means, the fact that I haven't got a single mute, even though I've gone yellow contaminated like twice. Actually, no, I did. I got the easier one. Never mind, never mind. I was kind of hoping for a moment there that uh, they'd remove that. I don't like malmutation, but, you know, it's 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 a it's a part of the game, so what are you going to do about it? I, I'm no coder. I don't fix the game. I just play it. <laughs> Alright. Continuing on. So this uh, this centaur warrior is a little bit a little bit weak now. Uh, we I have enough dodge and a little bit of AC, so I can kind of fight these guys toe to toe. Uh, but once my deck, once my electrocution weapon comes online, it's, it'd be pretty fun. Whoops! I accidentally read a sound scroll. <sighs> once my blade comes online, it should be very nice to just be able to fight them out. Um, can I confuse you, please? Thank you. I appreciate it. Alright, what's this guy? What's he doing? Yeah, just keep being confused. Thank you. Very much. Alright, I'm getting a sick number of chain stabs right now. Uh, that had to end someday though, and it did. What a shame. What a shame. Alright, so that... Uh, this purple elf can summon greater demons and also abyss me. I don't want any of that, so I'm just gonna leave all the way back here. I'm gonna let this invis thing follow me. Uh, it was actually very useful there the invis thing because it actually gave me um what's that what's going on here uh no it it gave me vision blocking i guess which is good uh i'm using tukima's dance to just disarm the strong enemies uh and turn their weaponry against them that's going to help me i'm going to cast regen uh, i was a bit silly and i forgot to cast my defensive buffs and i i paid for it so you know you get what you dish out. Oh, you get what you put in. I don't know. There's a saying here. I don't really remember it. I'm, I'm bad. I'm actually very bad at sayings. Um, yeah. Mm. Why is there an enemy in there? That wasn't one before. Alright. Tukima's Dance. Yeah, Tukima's Dance is making quick work of these guys. Mostly because the damage output of uh, the spell is pretty high. Um, like, a dancing, a dancing halberd does way more than an enemy with a halberd for some reason. Uh, it might have something to do with the hit dice or something. I don't know. Plus one on your evasion. No thank you. That's not very helpful for me. I don't need... If you could give me six like last time, that'd be really great. I'd like that. Uh, I'm just spamming invis because there's a lot of corpses here. I can just eat. It's basically free. Uh, I just need to worry a little bit about contamination, but that should be okay. Um, this large abomination is not dying very quickly to me, so... I'm not too sure what I should do here. 
Do I have a strategy against this? No. Interesting. So I just got hard counted, I guess. Um, can I use a lampify? Maybe this will aid in my. Oh wow, this thing is hurting like crazy. Okay, well the lamp of fi fire thing was helping me out briefly there. Uh, it's not getting confused at all. I'm gonna throw some fire bolts at it. Maybe that's gonna get it. I'm pretty much trying to. I'm hoping for the lucky hit where I like kind of drain the mon of that thing, but whatever, it didn't happen. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Uh, moral of the story is don't let the uh, thing get too. Ooh, this is a tentacle monstrosity. I think I have the uh, power to deal with that, so I'm just gonna run away. Uh, it can open doors apparently. That's really bad. Okay, I don't have a single spell that I can deal with this, I don't think. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to run. Um, I need to use that demon blade now, please. Okay, let's see. Let's. Okay, so the reason why I switched it to B is because you can press the uh, comma button. Uh, wait, no, apostrophe button, and it switches between your A, the weapon in your A slot, and the weapon in your B slot. So I'm going to use that now for quick swapping my weapons. So let's uh, let's see if this. Oh wow, that's that's really good. Okay, so this blade is. Um, it's doing it's making some quick work of enemies that I wouldn't be able to normally kill. So yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Both my weapons are up to eight now. So. Nice, sweet. Uh, I guess I'll just use the demon blade to fight enemies that I'm not going to stab. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to be playing that optimally and just doing it for every single one. But you know, for some uh, enemies that like you know, I obviously can't take on with the dagger. I'll just sneakily use the electrocution. All right, cool. Uh, they stepped on a zot trap, but for some reason it didn't do anything. It just summoned these weak dudes. That's fine. Uh, what, what's going on here? Why are there so many enemies in the places that I've already killed? I'm gonna go invisible. I'm just gonna start stabbing. Uh, invisibility is a fairly good spell, I think. Uh, it's it gets you about two runes, maybe. Uh, depends on the uh, branch, of course. Uh, as you can see, the spy the swamp did not really care a lot about the my use of invisibility, so it yeah, I don't know. Okay, so I need to get rid of this elf in my way really quick, and I need to anti-magic this guy. So my bite has anti-magic, and that's going to help me out a lot, because it's going to mean that he can't cast too many spells. That's an Ice Fiend. I'm waiting for it to... Uh... I'm hoping that it desummons itself. Yeah, it did. Okay, good. I need to kill this... Yeah, that's why I need to kill it. Okay, so this is the interesting and funny part about this. I'm actually just going to get the rune right now. I'm too lazy not to get it. Um, and I'm going to show you... And this is the perfect example of why. This character is completely equipped to take on the rune right now. I don't actually care that much about the fact that I got Abyss. It's, if I treat it as an eventuality, I might as well take it. You know. So what I'm doing here is I am... Uh, I'm basically using Ashen Zarya's thing to scout around me and see if I can find the portal. Uh, and once I see a portal, I head towards it. That's pretty much the strategy. Uh, my high stealth should let me avoid a lot of enemies that I otherwise wouldn't. And whatever I don't avoid, um, I'll just use Ashen Zarya to avoid. Okay, so I'm waiting for Ash to give me some indication of something. Alright, so that's a portal out. I don't want to go for a portal out. I want a portal in. Keep going deeper, please. Uh, Abyss really wants me to leave. I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna leave now. Uh, it's not it's not a big deal. It's a little bit of a risk to take the rune at this stage, but it's fine. If they wanna just give me that, I, I don't really care. Not a big deal. So I'm getting corroded. Uh, I'm gonna put my armor thing on. Okay. It's good. Okay. Fine. These guys are still not sure where I am. That's funny. Okay, I'll stab the knight in case he does any damage. Alright, so this elf is taking ages to kill. I should have used my sword. I think it's because of the preserver. I'm not sure though. I'm still not getting used to the fact that I have a sword in my inventory. Uh, I can't stab that, can I? Alright, I need to cast Tukima's Dance on you. Okay, good. Excellent. Yeah, I'm just disarming these enemies. It makes them less of a threat, which is good. 
I guess I can use Insulsal, but not, it's not that necessarily necessary anymore. Even though it gives me a better stab. Uh, let's let's go Invis, and we'll just kind of. Okay. Yeah, this Demon Blade is making quick work of all these enemies. That's good. I like that. I'm gonna keep continue. Um, I'm gonna continue exploring this floor. Uh, stab you to death. You can go invisible. Yeah. So this this is fairly straightforward now. Uh, I wanted to talk about something, but I forgot in the all the chaos. So uh, let, hmm. Uh, hmm, I don't know. I don't know. It was it was something interesting. Boris. Mm, okay, so this character probably can't handle Boris. I don't think. Not at this stage. Actually, wait. No, I have um. I have uh, anti magic on my weapon, uh, on my bite. Maybe I can take care of him. Maybe he doesn't one shot me, please. One time. Okay, I'm just tabbing really slow, really slow. Okay, so he hit me with a weak orb. That's fine. Okay, bolt of cold. That's fine. Got him. Alright, good. So haste is down to 8%. <clears throat> We're gonna turn it off soon, that's okay. Fighting's up to 14. I think I'll turn it off when it gets to 15, just because I feel like anything else, uh, anymore, it's not really gonna be that great. Alright, good, good, good. Uh, I'm use you, you can see a little bit now that I'm starting to use the Demon Blade more. I'm just getting lazier and lazier, I guess, as it gets on. Uh, it's not like it's a bad thing, it's just the fact that you know, it's a, it's a lot of effort to just keep switching between weapons and like thinking about which one's the best one. I'm not going to go stabs. If I'm not going to go stabs, then I'll just fight it out. It's okay. Like, they're equally good ways of fighting. Especially now that I have haste. I can just constantly haste myself. Uh, I don't have to like treat it as a commodity, like where I did before. Alright, this dagger is getting... Uh, this blade is getting pretty strong now. I can still kind of stab, which is cool. Uh, I'll stab now. I'll make sure the Ogre Mage dies first, and then I'll just stab the rest of these guys. Alright, cool. Yeah, that's excellent. I have two scrolls of blinking now, that's good. This floor's been nice to me. It's giving me some stuff. I can't even use invisibility with a sword. It, it really doesn't matter. Stealth, I think stealth does give me some bonus damage when I hit stuff. But, you know, for the, for the enemies I want to kill with a stab, I'll probably just you know, use the dagger. It's, it's got a lot more damage on it, surprisingly. Uh, I put him to sleep. I put him to sleep. That was kind of pointless. No no real point in hexing enemies at like long range, I guess. It's, it's not really going to help. So that simulacra didn't notice me, and then it got confused. And now it's dead. Good. Uh, Ring of Fire, don't need it. Don't need it. Um, let's see, 50%. Alright, let's get rid of his weapon. That makes him significantly less powerful. And just kill him. Very simple. Very straightforward. And there I got a really cool amount of stabs. Uh, I prioritized the blue one. Uh, but obviously I wouldn't... I don't want to mess up. Like, I didn't get to go for the green one, basically. Huh, okay. So, can he see invisible? He can. Dawn. What do I do? Okay, I'm going to just two chemas and then demon blade. Yeah. Yeah, Demon Blade's pretty cool. Uh, I always like the Demon Blades. They look like lightsabers. That's, I don't know. <laughs> that's why I like them. It's a sad reason, but it's a reason. That's why, I, that's the probably the only reason why I like swords, really. I don't really like the two-handeds that much. I like the Demon Blade. That's about it. So most of my characters will go Demon Blade, Demon Blade, or... Oh, sorry. Demon Blade, or... Ah, uh, I'm really out of it. I don't know what's going on. I'm just confused, um, delirious, I don't know, I'm just saying random things now. Alright, let's just keep going, let's just keep going. Hopefully I'll recover before the end of this, because I'm a bit messed up. Yeah, so as you can see, I got that a full stab, but I'm not actually doing a lot of damage with these guys. That's because stabs are best done with dagger. Everything else is just really crap. Alright, so on to Vaults 4. This character will not be doing Vaults 5. I can 100% guarantee you he will not be doing Bolt's fight. Right. Uh, at least not right now. He won't. Uh, and the reason why it's too hard. Uh, Bolt's 5 is way too hard. Uh, in, in my opinion, again. This is all my opinion. You could easily discount everything I said. There, there are probably 100 better players that are like, eh, nah, he's wrong. But, you know, I think 
that, so I'm gonna... Oh man, this is a lich there. Okay. Uh, I put myself in a bad position. I'm gonna have to uh, make amends to that right now. I need to hit this guy. Okay, good. So my anti-magic is doing wonders for me now. It's, it's taking away the threat of a lich. He, he got an executioner that hastes itself, but it managed... I managed to kill it before it, you know, killed me. Uh, execution is a very scary, especially for characters that can't heal like this. All right, let's see what this is. Book of Annihilations. Um. Okay, that's fine. So back in, if I had not found this demon blade, I probably would have gone for the poison arrow, and I would have used that as my main tool for killing stuff in the late game. That can't be hexed. So. Oh, and maybe crystal. Oh, no, probably not crystal spear. I would have used orb of destruction and uh, let's see. Oh wow, I'm taking a lot of damage from that. Aren't I? Oh right, I didn't have my ring of resistance on. I guess. There you go. All right, cool. Let's kill you now. Sick. Anyway, so had I not found this El Eroka, El Eroka, man, I don't. What is she doing in here? That's not... That's very... F you're very far out of your league, young lady. Get out of here. You can't even abyss me at this stage, I don't think. I don't think you have enough, like, power to abyss me. Oh, doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, I don't know what I was saying now. I got distracted by her. Uh, I'm taking a lot of damage. Can you see invisible? No. No. Oh, I can just put him to sleep. Okay, cool. I'll do that. I'll just kill you. I don't, I don't like you enough to put you to sleep. Alright, so let's continue. Wow, that thing woke up in like one turn. That's crazy. Oh, so someone's just commented on my YouTube channel. Thanks. Uh, wow, that's a lot of enemies. I'm gonna haste, and I'm, he's gonna wake up immediately, really? Alright, fine. Fine. If that's the way you wanna do it, that's the way you wanna do it, man. I'm not gonna judge. I'm gonna keep stabbing. I'm just gonna keep hitting away. I'm gonna regen and I'm just gonna pull back. Just keep pulling back. Now the pulling back thing isn't really doing anything for me. I'm just doing it because it's a habit. You just wanna kinda like keep fighting, keep fighting, and just control yourself, I guess. Control the the position of the fight. So I'm not really sure whether I want int or dex right now. I'm thinking more dex. Mostly because int isn't as necessary anymore. I'm not going for full spell casting. I'm just going for light spell casting. So, you know, int is good, but it's not amazing like it would be if I were heavy spell casting. Yeah, so scrying didn't really help me there, but uh, actions are scrying didn't help too much, but you know, uh, I have a lot of piety. I don't really lose it. I don't use ash piety quite as much as I do with every other god. And it's mostly because he just feels so powerful and he's passive. I don't really feel justified using Oh, what's this? The Dagger of Venom RC+. Plus. If it's plus 8 like it is, I'm just going to drop the Dagger of Draining. Thank you. Um, and it's also RC, which is kind of cool. On the off chance I need RC, that'll be a good find. Alright, none of these can see invisible. Wow, actually this guy can. Now, he, now he's dead, so it's okay. Alright, so Repel Missiles is doing wonders for me here. It's very good. It's keeping these Yaktors at bay. Uh, there's a whole bunch of undead here apparently. They're not gonna probably they're probably not gonna wake up to my sneaky sneaky stab stab strat. So I'm just gonna keep doing that. That was pretty satisfying. I got like maybe six out of eight? That's alright. Uh alright, nothing up here. Let's keep going. There's a lot of enemies over there. Uh don't know what that's all about. I'm gonna try Oh, what's this? This is Saint Roka. So can he see invisible? He can't. Okay, well this is going to be just a sad fight then. I'm going to stab him first. He's weak. What is he going to do about it? Nothing. That's fine. I'm surrounded by enemies. Doesn't matter. They can't see me. Look at that. Easy. That was good. I really like it when... Oh, okay. Apparently that Yaktor is too close for my liking. I feel a little pissed off. I tend to lose my combat, my temper in combat. That's... I'm not going to lie. That's actually kind of a good one for me. Oh man, I'm taking a lot of damage. Why am I so bad? Ah, and then this guy's gonna. Okay, doesn't matter. Uh, being pissed off in combat is completely fine for me. Uh, this character actually could do with free berserks. Uh, it's a bit dangerous, but the thing is, if you pick your fights carefully, you don't really care if it's dangerous or not. 
Oh, I forgot to keep my repel missiles up. Alright, so I'm getting a bit sleepy. Um, I know this one's a bit short, I think. Actually, it might not be. But, wow, that's a lot of stuff. Um, why is Terence here? That makes no sense. Alright, I'm just going to run for it. I'm going to run to the hills. I'm just going to get this guy's sword out of his hand. He's annoying. Uh, I don't know why there's so many enemies in this place, but alright, fair enough. I'll just uh, walk over here, I guess. Let them disperse out, and then I'll explore in there, all around. Uh, okay, so I'm yellow contaminating too much, and the reason why I'm doing that is because I'm hasting myself and then, and as well as invisible. Bleh. I'm making myself hasted and then invisible. And that's kind of, uh, yeah, that's making me contaminated quite heavily. So I'm going to try to stop doing that, I guess. I'll use one or the other. And I guess I'll do both if I'm in a lot of trouble. I think I misinterpreted how much, uh, how much stuff I'd get, uh, how much contamination I'd get. Uh, but again, being pissed off, it's an interesting one. I, for some characters, it can spell a lot of certain doom. Like, uh, let me think. I don't know. There's, there's a couple that, like, I just feel would be really scared to be berserk. But if you, if you play properly, the berserk actually kind of helps sometimes. Because you're just taking out one enemy at a time. And, like I am. Uh, if you're taking out one enemy at a time like me, can they see invisible? I hope they can't. They can't. That's nice. Thank you. Uh, come over here. Guys, come on. Come over here. Erica, you can't even see me. What are you doing? Oh, now you can see me. Whoops. Alright, let's just stand in this doorway, I guess. This corridor. And just regen up. Taking a lot of damage, but that's okay. We have regen! Yay! Uh, anyway, so, I'm getting a bit sleepy. Uh, mostly because, you know, it's been a long day. I uh, had a lot of work to do. Not really, but I'm going to pretend I did, so that people think that I, d I do a lot of work. I don't. Uh, I just enjoy playing Crawl, but for some reason today I'm just feeling a bit out of it, so I'll probably take a break and then... Ooh, it's long, a great sort of pain. That's kind of cool. Uh, you know, I'll take a break and I'll come back when I'm a bit more rested. Might take a nap. Uh, so I'll just finish this floor. Ow, this guy. Oh, right. The weird thing about vine stalks is that they're immune to rot. Probably because curing um, doesn't work that well on them. So, yeah. I guess that ghoul wasn't that dangerous. Wow. <laughs> okay. Just gonna keep clearing this dumb vault. Can this seem invisible? Can't. Alright, I'm just gonna go invisible. Stab the crap out of these. All good, all good. What's this? Dagger of Venom. Man, I have a lot of daggers of venom. Uh, let's, let's see. Dagger and and brand. So venom, speeds. Wow, that is a lot of daggers of venom. I, I, I mean, I guess it makes sense because I went to snake, but still. It's a lot of daggers of venom. Alright, so long swords is at 12. It's almost done. Hooray. Uh, we'll be done at 14, so. What's Snorg doing here? See, that's not an enemy that I should need to be fighting. He's weak. Uh, that was a really weird and kind of cool vault. Uh, there was just a lot of low-level enemies that none of the which could see invisible, so that was kind of easy for me. All right, cool, cool. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and recharge this random teleport scroll uh, wand. I mean, why not, right? Teleport's always good. Having more is not a big deal. Uh, and I'm going to use it eventually. Alright, so I'm going to go to depth and I'm going to end it there. And I'll probably take a nap, come back, record another piece uh, while this one's uploading. Or after this one uploads. Uh, and I'll see you guys next time.